Hi, everyone. Hey everyone, welcome back to my Pokemon TCG random opening. If you want elaborate details on how all this works, then check out the first video of the series for all the details. Otherwise, let's proceed. If I land on yellow, I actually noticed this too. I forgot to put the Uno cards from the last opening back into the machine. I'll just put them over here. Anyways, if I land on yellow, I'll open for packs. I'll open one of these and one of these, so that's gonna be yellow. If I land on blue, I have another one of these that's appropriate with the matching colors. It's another three pack of evolutions boosters in this blister. So that's blue. For red, this one's really exciting. Much older box. This is a chest bin box that gives you three black and white boosters, a chest bin foil promo, and the figure as well. That's gonna be awesome if I, if I get red. So there you go. Yellow, blue, red. And of course, the wild spot is anything goes. The black plus four spot, like that right there, is the bonus round. Okay. Let's give this a couple taps. And here we go. Three, two, one. Wow. Another bonus spot. Anything goes. Okay, let me take the time to think about this as I clear all this out. Hmm. Okay, I've decided what I want to open for the Anything Goes Wild Spot. I have two things. First of all, I might as well open this pack right here. The Series 4 pop pack that I showed off in, I think it was the last random opening. So there's that. But I also have this. I picked this up at Walmart the other day. The Mega Mewtwo X Collection Box. You get a Mewtwo promo card, a foil promo card that is, four random boosters, and a Mega Mewtwo X figure. So, Walmart had a rollback on their boxes like this. They were all $18, so I looked through them all carefully, and I know something really peculiar. Look at the figure. I don't think you can see it from this angle, so let me flip the box over and show it you from this angle. See that? Mewtwo is all in a pearl color. So I looked this up on the internet and found out that this box with the pearl Mewtwo figure is exclusive to Toys R Us. But I bought this at Walmart. I reckon someone during like the holidays got this for Christmas from Toys R Us and decided to return it and took it to Walmart instead. Because you guys know Walmart. They can pretty much take anything back. So yeah, I'm going to open this because also... When I bought this box, there was this as well. But I mean, everything is still intact, so there you go. So that's what I'm going to open for the Wild Spot. Let's go with the Series 4 pack first before I delve into the Mega Mewtwo X Collection box. Will I get anything good in this? This is what? 2006, so it's over 12 years old? Wow. I hope we get a foil at least. Okay. Here we go, guys. Let me get into position here. Alright. Oh boy. Here we go. This pack was $5, too, so it better be worth it. Let's see what side is the blue one. It's on this side. Let's do this first. I can't even get the thing out. Alright. There's your two cards. Here we go. First card is going to be... Pikachu! <laughs> Sweet. Let's focus that up. 50 HP. Spark for 20 damage. Does 10 damage to one of your opponent's bench Pokemon. Don't apply weakness and resistance for bench Pokemon. Okay, so that's the first card. Now, what's the second card gonna be? Three, two, one. A common Trico Delta species. 40 HP, with pound for 10 damage and shining claws for 10 damage. Flip a coin of heads that the defendant Pokemon is now confused. Delta species changes the type of the Pokemon in the card game. Trico should be a grass type, but 
It's a psychic type on this card. Unfortunately, I didn't get anything really that great in that pack, but I'll take the Pikachu card, because Pikachu is my uh, Pikachu's my favorite Pokemon. Okay, I'll put the cards over here. Okay, so let's go ahead and rip this thing open. They've already preemptively starless for me, so let's do this. And the very first thing to show off for this collection box is, voila, the pearlescent Mega Mewtwo X figure. I can't believe it, exclusive to Toys R Us, and I got this at Walmart. So I reckon this is going to be a very rare figure to collect, so I will hold on to this. Will this stand on its own? Uh, just barely. If I tap it a little bit. It's ready to fall over. So yeah, I'll have him stand right back there somewhere. Alright, he's gonna watch out for me for any good pulls, because I hope I get something good compared to the Series 4 booster. Okay. Of course, since I think I've opened this box before in the past, we all know what this card does, so I can pass that up. Uh, put it over here. And here is the online code card for this collection box. First one gets it. Ready? Three, two, one. Okay, so that's out of the way. Okay, so for the booster packs, you get one Ancient Origins, one XY Rowan Skies, and two Breakthrough. I think I'll do the Breakthrough ones first. I'll start out with... Hmm. Do you really think I should start with the Mewtwo one, since it is the Mewtwo box? I think so. This will be the first pack. I'll open them in this order. Alright. Come on, Pearl Mewtwo. Give me some good pulls for me. Here we go. First code card from the booster packs. Only take one code card at a time per video. Sharon is Karen. Okay. One, and two, and three. Alright, focus this up. Here we go. Got a Brakeson. Assault Vest. Floet. Panseer. Pancham. Inkay. Swinub. Starly. And here's the Reverse Foil. Another Brakeson. Alright. For the rare card, what will it be? Here we go. Three. Two, one, a smeargle. Oh god. Alright, next up. The next breakthrough booster. I hope I get a break card. Maybe it'll be this one. Zorak break. There's this one. Rippy Rippy. Trash is falling down. Okay. Let's focus this up. And here we go with a Magneton. Fisherman. Ursa Ring. Piplup. Hippopotus. Pansage. Routes. Scatterbug. I think next one's gonna be Reverse Foil? It is. Teddy Ursa Common. And for the rare card, come on, make it a foil. Three, two, one! Raichu? No way! Bad start, guys. Getting nothing yet. Breakthrough failed on us. How about Agent Origin? Come on. Ugh. Oops, I didn't open it all the way. Okay, got it. There's the next code. One, two, and three. Let's focus that up. Alright, Sceptile Spirit Link. Vespa Quinn. 
Pex Maniac, Inkay, Unown, Eevee, Persian, Porygon. Is next one gonna be Reverse Foil? I think it is. A Persian. Jeez, I'm getting nothing for Reverse Foils either. That sucks. Now the rare card. Three, two, one. Oop, I slipped. A Golurk? Ancient Trait? Wow. All poop rares. Orange Skies is the last chance to get something good. Well, this is probably one of the worst boxes. Other than the Pearl Mewtwo figure, that is. Come on, Orange Skies. Last code card, too. There you go. Oh, trash is starting to build up. <laughs> okay, here we go. Let's focus that up. Okay, for the last pack, I have an Unpheasant, Winona, Mega Turbo, Wurmple, Pikachu, Voltorb, Dunsparce, and Padove. Give me a Reverse Foil Rare! Oh my god! A Quinky Dinky. But still, it's a common. Oh, I got, I got a bad feeling I'm not going to get anything good for the rare card. So let's go with it anyways. Three, two, one. Of course. A dud box. But at least I got this, so I'll take it. I reckon this is going to get much rarer in the future as well, so there you go. Alright, so there you go, guys. That is the random opening for this time. And with that, that is going to do it. So I'll see you guys in the next opening, but until then... Like I always say, thanks for watching, and take care.